Cute. First she ate it. Where's this treasure chest at? Or loot chest, if you will. Eh, oh well. I'm not too worried about it. Alright. Well, I was right here, that little spot I was trying to climb. Three points of contact. I was like right here. <laughs> Lame. Alright. So, let's hop back in the boat. Which I will call a Zodiac until someone corrects me. I'm pretty fairly sure it is. But who knows? Whoa, whoa, whoa. That was... Oh, it was the shark that was red. Well, you know what, shark? <gasps> Screw you. There's another one right back there. Oh, well. We'll run over plenty of sharks in our days. Now, for exploration stuff... What do I have for those? I can make uh, three of them. Um, I guess I can put them there. I don't really want to. I think I'm just going to go into crafting and use them manually. Yeah. Let's actually get a little bit closer though. And I don't know how long deep dive is, if it's just infinite breath until the potion until the medicine runs out, we'll find out. Alright, let's let's do this. I ain't scared of no sharks. Scared of no sharks at all. Um, seems like just infinite breath as long as the medicine's going. Which is cool. So we'll we'll go top side now, I guess. See that's not too bad. Nice little dive with a diving potion. Easy peasy, lemon squeezy. And those racing ones, like for the 100% part, it, I don't know if I'll get 100%. I guess there's some vehicles and crap that count towards it. I don't really care about like, oh, I drove a vehicle for 100%. Huzzah. But if there is an achievement for it, I may do it. I mean, the story missions won't take me more than too long. I mean, I think I beat the game for the first time not knowing anything in 16 hours. This one's five, and in five hours I'm I'm decently far. Most of these missions that I have coming up now are quick. So I'm not too worried about the time though. Just worried about um having fun, you know, trying to do things that I haven't done before that are out of the ordinary and entertaining. Oh, it's on the other end of the island here. I'm not trying to be entertaining. I'm also trying to practice um, my speaking. And that's what uh, my new series that's going up, that went up on the channel the other day was the uh, gun checks with Zack Munster. Just uh, doing guns I hate to use and trying to talk while I fight off nine robots on regular difficulty, I believe. Doesn't seem like much, but um, it was fun. I I have already recorded, even even though I've only put up a couple videos. I have fully recorded it all by now. It didn't take too long to uh, set up a bunch of those games. Obviously, since the episodes are only going to be about 10-15 minutes long. Just me talking about the gun, talking about what I don't like about it, talking about what I like about it, talking about how I could make it more bearable. You know, just use stuff that gun videos are usually about. Um, you know, what? I took those. I took them out with the bow last time. Let's try out the predator a little bit more for this. Oh, they're on the other side of the hill. I wanted to get a nice vantage point of them. That's a bummer. 
Oh, we got a loot chest in here. Let's go pick that up on the way. I might have to sell loot soon. I think we're, uh, stocking up. But that's also a good thing because that AMR, if it's the sniper I'm thinking of, is very expensive. I think it's like three grand. So, and ammo for 50, or ammo for snipers isn't cheap anyway, so. Yeah, stuff like that. All that, all that good whatnots. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Hello. Oh, okay. Never mind. I totally spoiled that. You guys remember? I was like, yeah, and the stairs and the whatnot. No, that was a previous playthrough. Someone just effing shoot him. Get a grip. You're just looking. Find whoever did I don't know if he's going to connect or not. Kill one of us. I'm going to find you. Okay. Hey, I'm right here. You found me. You so sly. I didn't think you were going to find me. Hiding behind you and all being clever and one out. But you so good at hide and seek, good sir. You so good. Uh, you know what I like about these missions? They pay you 250 or something like that to do them. But the dude, the boss guy, like almost always has a hundred dollars and an item that's worth like a hundred dollars or eighty or seventy-five or something like that. I don't know. I just think it's interesting. Stop it. Stop stop being a floating cutting board or whatever you are. Stop it. You're scaring the children. Let's see, what is this? A sniper challenge, surf and turf, racing mission. Hmm. There is a relic here as well as a you know, let's go there. We can pick up the relic and and do a um side quest. I don't think we've done any side quests yet so far. And as a matter of fact, now that I think of it, I think I've only done two side quests in my entire, like, over a dozen playthroughs of this. <sighs> so, let's uh, sell some loot, all of it. Oh yeah, we can also use that uh, that Black Panther leather to do that. But let's check the AMR really quickly. Ah, it's, uh, it's a signature weapon. Customized Z93 with extended mag, high-powered scope, and custom paint. Fires an explosive, penetrating round, enhanced for long-range distance. Look at that. Max accuracy, max damage, max range. It is a beautiful gun. All right. And that is that is our end game, right there. Our end game sniper rifle, mainly for the explosive rounds that are piercing because they're a one hit to heavies. So, yeah, let's uh, refill on any ammo we're missing out on. And I do believe I'm waiting to get a one of the recipes for explosive tip arrows, but that might not even be until I get to the second island. And that, that shouldn't even be considered a spoiler. I mean, honestly. How long have all of us gamers been playing games like Grand Theft Auto? It's like, oh, there's more than one area? That's so weird. And what not. What does tagging the pass mean? Oh, 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 I've done this one. This is the, um... This is where you learn about the lost letters. And I do believe you get three free ones for doing that. Awesome. I need to get back up on this road because I forgot he's actually uphill. And he should be. Ah! Drive over the rocks like a crazy sir. I just skipped half that drive just by driving in a straight line and 
tanking boulders like it's nothing. Yeah, it is the uh, it is that one I was thinking of. Hi. Awesome. Selling? Selling, selling what? Seriously? The Jason Brody and you're not keyed in or nothing? It is cool. I'm gonna school you. <laughs> yeah, you do that. We're a legit enterprise, yo. These islands used to be crawling with Japanese soldiers. You find a jet body, you snag the dog tags, and we buy them. What do you get out of it? We use the tags to find their families if they still got them, and ship the bodies back. For a fee. Of course, for a fee. The families get their loved ones, and we get to keep operating. This ain't goodwill. Fair enough. I'll let you know if I find any tags. You're on board? <laughs> Hola! But I want you to get <laughs> this down to the families. <laughs> what? For real, real? You want the Jason Brody's help, right? Ah, fine. I'm so going to regret this. All right, let's go. Let's do this. Luckily, they make it very easy to find. I'm gonna go ahead and loot your house. Is that cool? Yeah, I know it's cool. Because I'm the Jason Brody, sir. And you ain't got nothing. You ain't doing nothing. And I believe there's a cave directly under this sir's house somewhere. I don't know where the entrance is. Wow, that did over a bar of damage and... Oh god! You hear that, like, flying noise, and I just scared crapless. I'm like, no, don't die. Yep, right here. Random temple with a <coughs> door that you can just knife through. Get some, get some loots. And if all goes well. No, it did not go well the heck? Oh, okay. See, seriously? Come on now. Aha! Uh, that. Wow, really? Just walk on through. Break on through to the other side. Awesome. That's a, that's a, that's a cheeky one. Look at that. That's a cheeky one. Any, any hidden nooks and crannies here? No? All right then. Anything on this side? I bet there is. But I have no good guesses as to. It's probably up top to be honest with you. Let's just go finish this mission, get some dog tags. Or not, yeah, dog tags. That's what it, that's what it is. Now, the nice thing about this is um I do believe that these dog tags also have letters of the lost on all of them. I'm not Sure, actually, now that I think about it. Unless the letters are... Interesting. Bing. Should be a dude right on the ground around here somewhere. 200... Oh my goodness, that is good money right there. There he is. Yeah. One tag. Oh, no, I guess there's no letters on these ones. Oh, God, this could be sketchy. No, no, no. I had a mini heart attack there because I haven't saved in a while. So, oh, right, right, right. You can't save during a mission, which this is technically. And uh, I was kind of hoping there'd be a letter on him, but oh well. Let's get some green herbs because we're gonna need them later for um some green leaves. My bad, leaves. We're gonna need them for the sprinting potion eventually, I believe. I don't know when that is that we're gonna get that. I just know we will eventually. As I've said before, it is my favorite. Favorita. Nope. Second tag. Is the second tag, Senor? No, this is a completely different thing right here. 
Oh, well, Zeus. Oh, you know what? Before I forget again, why don't we go ahead and go to crafting and beef up our syringe kit with the Black Panther leather. How's that sound? Twelve syringes in this plus-sized case. Nice. So why don't we beef it up? We have seven. How many of these do we have? Oh, just one. Um, that's pretty good. Is that not a fort? Because that would be a really fun fort to... Or outpost to infiltrate. Ah, it's pretty small. Never mind. Something like this where it's completely surrounded on three sides would just be really cool to me. I suppose I could not skip out on the loot, though. Yeah, I'm here, right? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, 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 snap. Alright. What are we on now? Episode... Well, depending on how long I cut these into. Could be looking at 15. We could look be looking at 30 minutes. Possibly 45. Possibly. We may never know. Wow, this mission paid off almost Last tag. 500 or something. Um... I think we've gotten probably three or four hundred just from looting those chests. And I think he might pay us a good amount. So, doing these side missions really isn't a bad idea if you need money. And if you want to, like, if you want to collect all the special, all the signature weapons, all the weapons, all the attachments, all the paints. Which you don't need to do, but if you want to. Oh, I was right here. <laughs> Smart. Yeah, if... We are done, man. You are a machine. You gave us enough to keep us busy for a year. Sweet. How much did you get? 500. Yeah, we almost made a grand off that. Holy crap. So now we're gonna... We got the relic. We got all that good stuff. Um... I guess we keep going with the... Moving... Moving east and doing wanted dead missions, as well as hunting, and I might do a side mission here or there. What I want to know is, did I do the, um, where for out thou, Romeo, Juliet, whatever, Romeo and Juliet mission? I don't remember if I did or not. Wow. You know, I'll keep that leopard skin. Um, ooh, tribal knife. Let's equip that. I do believe it does a lot more damage than the machete. I don't know what's better, the tribal or the tanto. I'll probably use the tribal just till I get that. The tanto. As far as maps, we need the, we have the items, but we don't have the Hubert Shore maps. I'm probably not going to get the loot until I have, like, nothing else to buy. Because, honestly, I can come across loot just fine doing missions and side quests. 175 to pop a dude? Oh, this is that one I started a while back and just quit. Mm. Yeah. 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 Wish I had an ender pearl right now. Just pull an ender pearl out of my pocket and be like, <laughs> bah! Wait for it. Wait for it, and then bing, right into the middle of their camp. Pop a dude, pop a dude, and knife the guy. Oh, wow, that's a lot smaller than I thought it was going to be. That preview picture looks freaking huge, but I guess. Oh, by the way, for whoever it was that was telling me it was a combat knife, did you guys go back into that store and look and see that it said machete? Ha! Girl. Try to tell me it's a combat knife, you cursy. Ooh, where, 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 where? I need dogs. <sighs> I 
wonder what these aren't ra these aren't wild dogs these are just dogs weird wonder what they're doing here um was that enough to make the thing I'm not sure oh yeah it just didn't tell me and we need boar hide if we ever come across it I do kind of want to get like all of the all of the pouches and stuff which is kind of why I'm doing that this looks like something I can walk on ha screw your climbing animation even though I have to do it here <laughs> shh This environment climbing that they added is just awesome. Like Far Cry 2, you couldn't go somewhere, you just didn't go there. Far Cry 3, they tried to make sure that if you wanted to get there, if you were clever about it, you could get there. I love that. I'm so glad. I'm so glad they did that. But then again, they do they do make uh, Assassin's Creed, I believe, so it was bound to happen. Put some parkour into their other games. Ooh, can we get the uh, upper advantage here? Potentially uphill advantage? Yes, no? Heck yeah, we can. And right at daybreak, too. I like it. Looks like we got some sirs hiding in, in spots that make Zach ha unhappy. I think I see a guy through the bushes there. Yep, there got, there's got to be more than just two guys, but we're going to go in pistol this time. We did a bow, we did a sniper. Let's do a pistol this this time. It seems like I don't use my suppressed pistol that often, and I should. I really should. Oh, God. What the dumb? What? Nothing. Whoa! Oh! Thanks, guys. That's helpful. Appreciate it, man. Men? Men? You! You're the man. You the man, sir. Alright, we got some handgun ammo out of that. Yeah, I really need to work on my iron side aiming. I don't... I need to... I think I can actually put some nighttime sights on there. I, that's what I actually usually do now that I think about it, as I put a night sight on it. But, um... I think I have a second attachment on here, or I can only have one, but I don't remember. Um, 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 um. What's this mission here? Is it that Romeo and Juliet one? Come on now. Yep, where far art thou, Juliet? Yep. Um, that one's pretty straightforward. Just cross the bridge, kill some things, and you're golden. So, why don't we do that next time? I... I am your host, Zach Munster, and I will make sure to pause long and awkwardly so that the audio editing doesn't get cut out like it always does. So we'll see you next time.